Hey YouTube, it's me, your girl, Jess Kanana, coming to you with yet another sexy video. Um, this is a video response to Black Onyx 77. That's my girl. She is really, she's really like a genuine sweet person. Um, but I'm doing a video response. She got tagged by one of her subscribers, and at the end of her video, she says, if anybody wants to give me five random facts about yourself, go ahead and leave it in a video response. So that's what I'm doing. Um, first things first, I am happily married to my husband of four and a half years, well, or more than four and a half. February 5th is going to be our fifth anniversary. I'm very, very blessed and honored um, for us to cross paths. Uh, it's, it's crazy how we met, but I'm grateful. I'm so grateful for that way. Um, the Most High designed it just for us, and I'm grateful for that. Um, also, I have a two-year-old son from him, of course. He's the baby daddy. He is the baby daddy. Um, so, yeah, two years old. His name is Jonathan, and I love him so much. He's such a gift. Um, I had a beautiful pregnancy with him. Like, seriously, I didn't, I threw it once. Um, that's because I ate something bad, <laughs> and that was like five or six months into the pregnancy. Um, but I, I, I did, I was consistent with my prayers to the Most High God. I said, you know, let this pregnancy be beautiful, no complications whatsoever. And I'm so grateful that the Most High, you know, answered my, my prayer. Beautiful pregnancy. He was actually two days past the due date, what the doctors say, whatever they say. Um, so his birthday is uh, June 29th and he'll be three next year. And, um, yeah, no complications whatsoever. I mean, 100% natural birth. I would have had him in water, but I didn't have a midwife. So, But I went to, like, the best uh, children's hospital, not children's hospital, the best hospitals to give birth, birthing centers, I guess you want to call it. Um, so I, I, no drugs, okay? You can do it. All those women that say, oh, you're going to need drugs, you're going to need this. Don't listen to them. Take your Lamaze class. Have your easy birth. I'm serious. It was beautiful. I He came out in three pushes at the hospital in, uh, in labor for uh, three hours. It, it was a beautiful thing. But anyway, so that's one and two. I'm going to say that. Okay. Um, number three. I love, absolutely love ice cream. Like seriously, I can eat for breakfast, lunch, and dinner. It's that bad. And don't get me started with the, the ice cream and Kool-Aid. Now, don't knock, don't, don't, don't even make that face. <laughs> don't knock it till you try it. Put you some vanilla ice cream and whatever flavor Kool-Aid. Red, grape, red, grape, no. Strawberry, grape, you know, whatever. Blueberry, whatever Kool-Aid. Try it, y'all. Y'all gonna make me go to Walmart tonight and get some ice cream and Kool-Aid. Like, seriously, it's so good. Um, but, co oh yeah, anyway, so, that's number three, right, four, um, let me see, I, I was raised in, um, a musical family, um, uh, my mom sings and she plays the piano, my dad sings, my older sister says she can't sing, but she can really sing and she can harmonize like crazy, um, and my older sister that's only a year older than me, she sings opera, um, so she's doing her thing. She's like off the chain. Like um, and my baby brother, he sings, plays the keyboard, guitar, drums, bass. Uh, he picked up for the uh, he picked up the saxophone for a minute. Um, he he he's oh man, he's crazy talented. He's a he writes uh, music. Oh, uh, he's off the chain. Like seriously. Um, and who else? My sister in law. Well, she's she just married into the family about a year ago. She's she's crazy too with her vocals and she can write real deep. Her and my brother, I just love it. Like I love it. Um, and so I sing, I play keys, guitar. Not great at either one of them, but um, <laughs> I'm gonna get there. But singing is my my number one thing. Um, my husband plays the keyboard. Stay tuned for videos from him. Um, he's going to put some on my channel of him playing. Um, my son, he's into everything. Drum, I think drums is number one. And then keyboard, 
number two and then guitar. And whatever else he sees, he's so inch like he can seriously sit down when I first had his drum set, he sat there as a drum set for two and a half hours. We came home seven o'clock PM, we pulled him off at nine thirty because of course it was time to go to bed and he kicked and screamed about that. Like he's my little musician. But yeah, I used to sing this uh, recording group, national recording group, um, Jimmy Hicks and the Voices of Integrity. I don't know if you've heard of them. Um, it's like a, what do you call it, traditional type music, which is not really my feel, but I wanted to be a part of it for the experience, and what an experience. I really enjoyed the people that I sang with and the places we traveled, like anywhere in America you can think, you know. And that was a beautiful experience. I miss that. Like right now, when I moved um, to live with my husband, we got married. I started doing like praise and worship at a couple churches. Um, but now I'm not doing anything. So I really, 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 really miss. I really miss that. Pray for me. Like if you know, like pray for me, seriously. Because that's a part of my life that is lacking right now. So. Y'all, did y'all see that serious side of me? Like, it was, like, real serious. I told you I could be serious. I've been trying to tell people I could be serious. And not clown all the time. But no, for real. But seriously. Yeah, I missed that part of my life. Um, I'm going to make that five. I think that was five. If not, sorry. It might have been four. But anyway, if it wasn't, if you want to know another one, just message me or comment or something out. I'll, I'll let you know if I dig something out. I'm not I'm not like oh my gosh you're so cool, yeah. You know? Well I am, but you know what I'm saying? It's not so I don't have so many layers. You know, you get what you see pretty much. So that is it I do declare. Oh I did my makeup guys. You should feel special. I'm serious. Feel special, because I don't really do it. Come on, you know what? My husband doesn't really like when I wear makeup. He doesn't get the whole thing. Like, he's like, babe, you're beautiful. Like, seriously, take that off your eyes. Like, seriously. I was like, man, I thought I was looking kind of sexy. You know what I mean? <laughs> you didn't try to cut me down like that. But no. But I honor that. I honor that. So, every blue moon, I do my makeup. Every blue moon. Seriously. But, you know, I try to, I try to be, like, his trophy wife. Like, he doesn't know that, but, like, seriously, like, because I know he's, like, around a lot of musicians and stuff like that, and I know all these little, these little girls that like musicians, so I try to keep myself very presentable, like, very sexual. Seriously, I keep myself very nice um, when I go out with my husband, because you don't know who's out there looking at your man. So, I gotta get it right, okay? So, I'm nice. Um, makeup. Um, but yeah, so that's one thing that I think why I love my husband so much because he loves me regardless. Um, when we got married, I was a lot heavier than this, and he loved me then. And you know, I didn't have the greatest teeth, you know what I'm saying? It's like little flaws that I, well, flaws that I thought were like extreme. It, he didn't, didn't even face him, you know what I mean? Like, he just, he asked me, he still asks me sometimes, like, if he sees somebody, like, that's tiny, 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 he's like, babe, why is she so tiny? I was like, babe, I don't know. That's just the way she is. But I, I can admire that he loves me, like, seriously. That's why, I, you know what, that's it. That's why I find it hard to get motivated to lose weight because my husband just thinks I'm so sexy, like, when I, y'all y'all think I'm playing, y'all probably like giggled or, you know, you know, <laughs> she crazy. But seriously, he really thinks I'm sexy, guys. And I'm, I just like, I know, I know I am, you know. It's like, you put two and two together, like, it's like I knew I was sexy and then he was like confirming it. Y'all, I'm, I'm a mess. No, no, seriously. No, <laughs> no, for real. No, for real. I'm not like that. But anyway, I'm going to let you go for real. Be good. Be blessed. Shalom.